Hello everyone and welcome back to the Class 47 Peter YouTube channel and welcome to another model railway review and in today's video I'm going to be taking a look at a piece of rolling stock and today I'm going to be taking a look at the Batman BR Mark 1 CCT in British Rail Research RTC livery <laughs> Now this model was first announced back in 2014. This particular model, along with a CCT in maroon livery, BR Blue, there was the BR Engineers Yellow and Express Parcels livery, were announced as exclusives for Invicta Model Rail. Now they are no longer in stock there in Invicta Rail and at present on eBay I have seen the maroon ones, the BR blue ones, and there is a BR engineers yellow one that I have seen on there, but I haven't seen, since I started looking for one of these, I haven't seen this particular one in the RTC livery on eBay. So I started asking around in these Facebook model railway trading groups, and someone got back to me who had one of these, and so I bought it, and here it is just now. And so I I'm really looking forward to getting this open and getting it on the layout so we shall do that now. With the model we get an accessory pack full of optional extras which you can either choose to fit these or not and there's various bits of detail parts in here I won't be fitting any of these to the model, but I shall keep them to one side in my spares box. So here we have the model out of the box, which is the bit that we're all here to see. And this is RTC item number 6 for my collection. And I'm really pleased that I've got this. And it certainly doesn't disappoint. So we'll make a start with the detail. So first of all we have plastic unspun buffers, though I don't really care about that. We have at least got some buffers on the model, so that's all that matters. We also have NEM tension lock couplings, which these ones are going to be replaced with the hunk couplings, which I now use. You can see we have all the holes in the buffer beam for the detail parts to go into. But I shall, I shall not be fitting those because they will more than likely just clash with the couplings and they'll just catch on it and they'll just fall off again. So those won't be fitted, but not that it necessarily needs to have those parts fitted. We've also got warning signs, crisply printed on the model on the front. And also, just look at all the detail there we go on the front. It is all moulded, but I think that that looks stunning. Also take note of the detail parts that are fitted underneath there, which they have been separately fitted. And also this model has metal wheels. This model also has separately fitted handrails on the model, on the body, which look superb and they've been well applied. On the body sides we have some nice rivet detail glazing in all of the windows and even right down to the battery boxes and the generator boxes the detail on this model is really impressive the detail on the roof is not particularly interesting to look at but we do have roof vents on the roof there which are part of the moulding of the roof. I now turn my attention to the livery application which is gorgeous as far as I'm concerned. Again as I've said before I do love the RTC livery 
you've got the blue and then you've got the red and then you've got the fine white lining that goes around the outside of the red which in my opinion really does set this livery off very well and you've also got the British Rail Research Derby RTC text with 024497 which is the running number of this CCT crisply applied on the body sides so it really is a well applied livery there's no errors in the paintwork at all or marks anywhere it is a superb factory finish so we've got the British Rail Research RTC BR Mark 1 CCT being pulled around the layout by the Sutton's Locomotive Workshop Class 24 which has the honour of giving this CCT of what is its first run because it's never been run before this model the CCT that is and the CCT it runs as sweet as a nut it runs very smoothly no derailments it's a smooth runner as you would expect it to straight from the box So that's another piece of RTC rolling stock added to my collection of RTC livery stock that I'm currently building up and hopefully more shall be joining the fleet. So as an added bonus, I've got the Class 24 hauling some of my RTC livery stock around the layout. The only item that I have currently that isn't in this rake is my horn, the XLMS CCT. So I've got Laboratory 10 and the two Landor breakdown units, the new BR Mark 1 CCT, well, new to me anyway, and at the back, Laboratory 23. And just look at that. Doesn't that look spectacular? So that brings me on to my overall conclusion then for the Batman BR Mark 1 CCT. And so overall then, I think it's a very nice model. It has great detail on it. And if you can find one of these in the RTC livery and you're collecting RTC livery rolling stock, then it's something that is a must. So I definitely recommend this model. I do have another Batman. CCT in Tartan livery which you may have seen in a couple of my other videos that one will be used on my parcel trains this one will never be used on my parcel trains this one will be used in my RTC rakes only and I'm just so happy to be able to have this to add to my growing collection of RTC livery rolling stock so that's it then for this video and I hope you've enjoyed watching it. If you like what you see then subscribe to the channel, smash that like button and feel free to post a comment. Check out all my other videos and I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.